What are the specific construction activities that will take place? And how much space will it take up on your land? What kind of noise levels should you expect? Depending on the phase of the project, 4 to 16 people will be typically working on site during construction. As for noise, the sound from various types of machinery will be noticeable. One main noise source is the PD10 pile driver, which pounds the steel posts supporting the solar panels into the ground, creating a repetitive thumping noise. However, the PD10 pile driver is only used during installation of the foundations, and this is only used for about a month, so this noise will be temporary. Other equipment and noise includes tractor trailers, semi-trucks, forklifts, flatbed trucks, cranes, and cement mixers, all necessary for getting the project up and running. Again, this noise is temporary. Along with installing solar panels and connecting poles, a designated area called the equipment pad will be built within the leased land to house the electrical equipment for the solar farm. Depending on the existing setup, new electrical infrastructure may also be added to connect the solar array to the larger grid. Once operational, solar developers will occasionally do deliveries and vegetation management but major traffic is focused on the first half of project construction timeline, keeping activity minimal on your land.